All right. Here we are. Overwatch 2 versus Assumption University. We got some NECC action heading your way. It has been a hot minute since I have casted me some Overwatch 2, so uh, bear with me here as I get everything situated. Usually Juggle takes these, but he is unavailable today. Oh, how do I go... It's the F buttons? Okay. Alright, we got the team comps coming out here. It's going to be uh, multi-kill on Reinhardt. Your Sodium on Sombra. Vero on Kiriko. Crystal on Symmetra. And L on Brigitta. Kill's going to get right into the point. We are brawling immediately. War Explorer gonna get a kill right away, make it two, and just like that, the Eagles will all fall, except for Sodium. First fight goes the way of Assumption. The Eagles gonna have to try to regroup here, but uh, meanwhile, for Assumption, we've got Carter on Reinhardt, Tanky on Symmetra, 4x4 on Reaper, IC3P on Lucio, and Katori on Bath. Pack goes down onto the opposing Reinhardt. Spell trying to take some space here. Trying to walk up. You can swing that hammer. Going into the blender here. Getting tagged very low and will get taken down by Tanky. Using that opening there. Take down Kel and now Eagles have to back off without a tank. Kel getting very low. She's going to fall as well. And this is going to be uh, a full retreat for the Eagles. Carter with another kill onto L. The Eagles just forced back towards their spawn here. Feels like selling, huh? Big ultimate here from Carter, and that's going to be another team fight win for Assumption. It's been all Assumption so far here in map one. Sodium swapping to Junkrat and Crystal swapping to Soldier here. Oh, and Crystal just getting tagged down <coughs> from up top. But Kitsune Rush available for Bureau. Kitsune Rush going onto the point. Oh no! But 4x4 was waiting in the wings with that Death Blossom. And uh, that is going to be a clean 100 to 0 assumption win on the first point of Li Zhang here.
Teleport coming right onto the point. Already two trade kills for each team. Kel trying to get that charge. Can't quite land it. Does get pinned by Carter, but Carter goes down. And now Kel needs to get some heals. As Sodium takes out someone else. And uh, that is going to be Post University's first team fight win here. <clears throat> Reinhardt, Reinhardt, Kel needs to cancel that charge. Getting taken pretty low. Fire Strike goes down. So much damage coming out. Force 4 finally takes him down. And the Eagle's going to be without a uh, tank now. But Sodium doing a ton of damage. Finally gets taken down by Carter. And uh, Vero in trouble. She is going to also get taken down. But Post will manage to get 32% uh, on the point. Oh, hey, Baller. I'm going to put it up on YouTube later for you. I'll ping you in the Discord chat when it goes live. I'll upload it tonight. Kel, 72% to a uh, shatter here. Eagles moving around to the left. They're going to have to go through these uh, Symmetra turrets, though. Which they cannot see. Oh, wow. Already 4x4 with a pick. Make it two as the Death Blossom goes down. Massive charge from Kel. He gets another one, keeping this fight winnable, but he's the only one alive. Throwing that solo shatter, just trying to stay alive, eventually goes down. Ooh. Do, I do not know about that shatter. That was uh, probably not the call. As he was completely alone. Sodium swapping to Farah now. Vero swapping to Mercy. Probably a good call. Uh, Assumption doesn't really have uh, too much that can deal with Sodium if he gets up up top. Finally goes up, but here comes the hammer. Tries to boot Carter off, but he's still there. Still getting healed, still surviving. And Assumption wins yet another fight. Sodium trying to survive, but gets staggered. That's going to be tough. Kel now swapping to Sigma. But is it going to be too little, too late? There's going to be last fight territory probably here. The post. Oh, and here's uh, Sodium coming in through the window with the Nano. Doing lots of damage. That's two kills already. Does get taken down, though. And now Crystal, the last DPS left as the Visor is going to pop it here. But that's a massive shield she has to get through, and she just cannot. Carter finally does go down, though. Crystal has to touch. Kel is also dead here. This could be it. Eagles coming in one by one, and that's going to do it. Assumption takes the first map 2-0. Really clean first map there from Assumption. Showing their mastery over Li Zhang. Carter the play of the game here on the Reinhardt. Oh yeah, this is when uh, 4x4 was waiting with the Death Blossom. Fire Strike. Oh, it was the Fire Strike through the window. It wasn't even the Death Blossom. The Death Blossom was just icing on the cake. Bye guys, have a good night. And uh, just like that, 15 minutes and Assumption out to a 1-0 lead. And uh, we'll be right back with map two.
All right, we're back with map two. It's going to be King's Row. Battle draws near. Ready yourselves. Damage output increased. Helping those in need is its own reward. Alright, here we go. It's going to be Kel on Orisa, Sodium on Junkrat, Vero on Mercy, Crystal on her patented Torbjorn, and L on uh, Lari. Meanwhile, it's going to be Carter sticking to uh, Reinhardt, M-Bomb on Bastion, Forks 4 on Widow, and IC3P on Mercy, and Katori on Alari. <laughs> really good damage coming out from Kel here. As Assumption trying to take space. No kills just yet. Crystal getting a little bit low. Carter getting a pretty low himself. Javelin coming out. Nice kill there by Sodium. Gets a double kill for himself as uh, IC3P was coming in to try to res. And uh, Assumption going to be in full retreat mode now. Kotori gets taken down by Crystal on the back end as well. Good stagger there. And uh, Forex 4 not finding too much value on this Widowmaker yet. <laughs> Interested to see if he swaps off. Crystal on the newly buffed Torbjorn. Throwing out some serious damage. Almost has the Molten Core available as well. Two kills traded back. Crystal also getting low. Rez comes out onto uh, multi kill. That's really important for the Eagles. Crystal getting low again. Almost has that Molten Core online. There it is. Finds the kill on the Bastion. And can hold on to this ult as well. This is huge for the for the Eagles. I won't let you fall. L swapping to uh, oh, oh Scar, sorry, I thought that was um Ilari. It's actually Anna. My bad. Ooh, four x four with a pick onto Crystal. That's massive. L trying to sleep Bob, but it doesn't quite go through. Multi kill kind of in trouble here. Getting a lot of heals from L in the back line. Both just trying to buy time here. Great ult there from multi kill. But here comes the Bastion ult down onto the point. Kel's going to be taking a lot of damage here. Can he survive? There's the Graviton Surge as well. Can Kel survive? He is still surviving up in this front line somehow. The heals are insane. Big anti-nade goes down. Kel with a pick on M-Bomb in the back line. That's huge. They do get the point, though, as the Post was not able to uh, put a body on the point. And now uh, Post going to back off here, try to fall back to the choke. Almost getting the Ash. Yeah, Forks for swapping onto the Ash. Definitely a good call, I think. He's able to uh, get a lot more value there. Vero with a res onto L. But M-Bomb taking Crystal down. And Post still forced to back up. Kel getting very low. Vero trying to keep him up. Somehow does so. Good shield coming out there from Carter as he has now swapped to the Zarya. Marissa ult online for Kel. See if he chooses to pop it here. Nice javelin there on the ash. 
window. Here comes the ultimate. Tags three, but there's the Bastion. Or excuse me, the Bap coming in to help. Holy kill just in it with everyone. Four x four gets two kills. This is looking like a very slow uh, team fight win for Assumption. Finally goes their way. Ooh, tire. <laughs> gets taken down by ic 3 ps pistol. Good try there from Sodium. Kel gonna swap to uh, Reinhardt here. He'll need to stall for time until L gets back. Another Graviton Surge will grab three. This is gonna be tough. M Bomb with two. Eagle's gotta regroup now. Kel trying to fall back. Not give this Assumption team more ult charge. Stand up Alright, post refreshed and ready to come back out for another fight. A little under three minutes left on the clock. Let's see how long they can hold them. Bob coming down on the back line. Kel in such a tough spot here. Pins Bob off the edge. Good job there, but he falls. Crystal now kind of alone. Taking on the whole team, and that is probably going to do it. Yep, a 2 minute 37 three point push for Assumption. That is going to be tough to match for Post. They did do a good job holding them off for a while uh, on that first point, but Assumption came back really strong uh, throughout that escort portion. We go on a lovely drone tour of King's Row. It's kind of, um, it's kind of, uh, kind of nice, I'm not gonna lie. I wish I knew why my screen was tearing like that. Is it not tearing on the stream? I'm trying to get it to, I'm trying to look at the stream, see if I can. Oh, interesting. It's not tearing on stream. Huh. Okay. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Hello. Hold your thumbs and we'll get through this all right. Kel swapping a Sigma, Sodium on Ash, Vero on uh, Mercy, Crystal on Torbjorn, and L swapping to Zenyatta. Okay. Really interested to see how L does on Zenyatta. I don't think I've seen her play this hero before. Ooh, Kel gets walled off. This is dangerous. He's taken very low. And M Bomb with the kill on this May. A good pickup there for uh, for Assumption. This first point pretty tough to take sometimes. Oryx for another uh, pick this time onto Crystal. Ooh, and Post just keeps getting picked off one by one before the fight even starts. Need to regroup here and try to push in together. Only 50% to the Graviton Surge. Or Gravitic Flux, rather. Crystal needs some heals here. It's taken down by 4x4. Not sure where the heals were there. Once again, Post unable to break through this Assumption defense. Again, Kel gets walled off and pinned. Somehow survives, though, and now has the uh, Gravitic Flux. Nope. Ooh, trade kills coming back and forth. 
Sodium gets two. Ooh, the Mercy gets the res off in the middle of everyone. No one could kill her. Sodium coming in. A little bit too close to that Reinhardt. Good use of the shift ability. The bomb gonna ult and go into that ice block. Sodium gets out. Somehow gets the heals. L with a good transcendence. But Carter finds that pick on Sodium. I don't know if this is going to be enough. They still got to kill this immortality. And Carter gets the heals that he needs to continue. Just taking this space for Pose. Kel going to get pinned up. Taken down to 20 health. Somehow survives. Getting that uh, heal from the Zenyatta. Post needs to seriously regroup here. Assumption's playing really well. Swapping to the Reinhardt. Less than a minute to go now. Post has got to win a fight and take control of this point. So this map's going to be over, and Post will be staring down match point. And Bomb just waiting for that wall. Wall is down. They got to go now. They all got to go in now. Here goes Kasuni Rush. Yep, there it is. Post coming in. But 4x4 has the visor ready, already takes down Crystal. Make it two kills with the visor. And just 30 seconds to go there. Post has got to start thinking about regrouping for one final fight. But it's going to be really tough. Oh, Sodium with a pick. That's huge. Oh, Kel's trying to push in to deny the risk, but he can't. He gets walled off. This may has been phenomenal so far for Assumption. Kel with a pin on to M-Bomb, but he can't get the kill. And uh, that's going to do it. No one left alive on the point. A clean 2-0 as Assumption takes King's Row as well. Or X for the uh, play of the game on Ash. All right, and we'll be right back with uh, map three in just a minute.
Okay, we're back. Map three, it's gonna be Suravasa Flashpoint. Eagle staring down match point. So far it's looked pretty lights out from Assumption as they have only really lost one team fight. <clears throat> it was back on Li Zhang Tower. Well, that's not true. They lost a couple uh, when Post was defending first point on King's Row. So I take that back. But Post definitely has a tall order. Oh, Winston coming out here. For uh, multi kill. Just nope, never mind. I lied. Brown, Swapping the jump. Okay, also, Joker Queen still pretty cool. I like it. Nope, never mind. Back to Winston. <laughs> Still pushing up on Soldier. We can get some early damage here. Very aggressive positioning. We're still trying to take the high ground here. Ooh, M Bomb already with a kill on Sodium. That's massive. Rear gets the res off of 4x4 with yet another kill. 
and the eagle's just taking so much damage. Kel trying to get out with Vero. Man, they just can't deal with M-Bomb's damage right now. Kel doing a good job trying to take space, but it just feels like it's not enough right now. Crystal trying to kill this bat, but he just keeps jumping, and now she's staring down a Bastion in turret form. Definitely not what you want. getting very low, but Kel doesn't quite have that burst damage on Winston as you may on other tanks to take him down. And uh, first point has been captured for a while now by Assumption. 35% multi kill jumping onto the point, but he just takes so much damage. It falls instantly. Sodium trying to do what he can here, but it's just so much damage. It actually kills himself on the uh, shield there. Crystal trying to heal herself up, but 4x4 is on the hunt. Takes her down with the melee, and the Eagle's just very staggered right now. Need to regroup. already a 100 to 0 uh, first flash point for uh, assumption and they are just all gas no breaks right now well, jumping in again gets that mega dueling Carter now on the point y'all just doing so much damage but uh, both not finding any kills <laughs> eventually gets pinned And uh, Post is going to try to get back in time to get in position for this next flash point. Captured instantly there by assumption as Post was not able to get in position. Sodium coming in on the Genji. Gets in, gets out. Doesn't do it, get any kills though. Or explore with a nice uh, helix rocket kill there. Make it another as he's now taking down a DPS and a support. Bella in the front line just getting absolutely melted, and uh, Assumption is just doing way too much damage here. That's going to be a visor for 4x4 as well. Sodium trying to get away, gets that mega away for now. Oryx 4 is just on an absolute tear. Sodium finally getting a kill on M-Bomb, though. Dashing up, he's got Blade available, too. Pretty low on health. Carter somehow doesn't get the pin there. Kel swapping to Ball. And gets one. Eagles need to find more, though, as they are trying to make space towards the point. And they just cannot touch in time. And that's already the second point now. Poor assumption. Sodium finally takes down crewmate on the BAP, though. Nice damage there from Kel as uh, Carter falls for the first time so far this map. And Post is going to have the slight upper hand heading into this next flashpoint. Ult economy, pretty even. Actually, in favor of post, they will actually have all five ults for this next fight. There's mines coming out right onto the point. Back visor for Crystal. And post will be winning a fight. They had to commit uh, three, four ultimates there. But they will capture the point and get their first percentages. I'm looking at Sodium here. He's got Dragon Blade available. He needs to try to find a flank angle. He can't just come at them right from the from the front. Comes 
Chance Carter dashing in. But Kel in the back line. Look at Kel doing a lot, wreaking havoc in the back line here. Carter dashing in again. Good pile driver there from Kel, but he gets taken down. Sodium. Oh no, he popped the blade while dying and ends up just dying and wasting blade. Unfortunate. Post does get 83% on the point, but it's looking like it's too little too late at this point. We'll see if they can regroup in time. Kel is rolling. Trying to get this back angle. Alvaro there only hits one. Kel's got his ult available again. Nice pile driver. Drop the mines. Drop the mines. He doesn't want to. I don't know why he's not dropping the mines. <laughs> Probably waiting for his team. Oh, M Bomb takes out Crystal. That's that's bad news. Ooh, Eagle, Eagle's just looking all out of sorts here, just getting staggered like crazy. They're gonna have to regroup now for a final fight. Oh, Vorex 4 with another kill on Crystal. Just absolute destruction from Assumption right now. And that's going to do it. The clean 3-0 sweep. And Assumption will take it. 3-0 and 3-0 on uh, Suravasa here. 4x4, the play of the game here, and probably the MVP overall, I would say, for Assumption. Yeah, Sodium is going for a hero play there, just got instantly shut down by the uh, visor. But yeah, that's going to do it tonight. We did the triple header. I got through it. Woo! <laughs> that was a lot. Oh, man. Chris Rammers, uh, Madden, close loss there. Baller, the uh, emphatic 2-0 win. And then Overwatch getting kind of rolled here by Assumption. Um, not going to sugarcoat it. Uh, that was a little brutal. But, um, hey, sometimes that's how we they go. GG's all around. Well played from Assumption. That's going to do it for us tonight. Um, we are going to have some Rocket League action tomorrow for you as we actually enter are going to be introducing a new Shoutcaster Bear Light uh, to our repertoire of Shoutcasters. So make sure to tune in tomorrow night for our uh, Rocket League game, which will be against uh, WPI tomorrow at 8 o'clock. Till then, thanks for watching, everyone, and you all have a great night.